welcome back to another video. I thought it was about time I go through my P.O. box. We have got so many things to go through. I have had a sneak peek because basically, let me just talk you through the process of my P.O. box. It's all delivered to my management's office, so at Gleam, and I go over there like a couple of times a week just to work and I go through my stuff and the things that I want to kind of take home with me to go through, I basically chuck in these bags and bring home. Um, but I haven't done this for a couple of weeks, so this is like two weeks worth, but I have very briefly gone through it at Gleam, um, just as I saw the stuff that I know I'm definitely not going to use and that I don't need at home myself, and that stays at Gleam, and it either goes to charity, to women's shelters, um, also, like, I let my managers go through it, so some of the girls take it, um, but the majority of it ends up in women's shelters, so that's amazing. And then I come home and I go through it myself and anything that I actually know that I really don't need, um, I either give to friends, family and again, charities. So yeah, I haven't done this video in a long, long time because I'm actually really limiting what I do bring home. So there hasn't been a massive amount to film to be totally honest. Um, since you've seen like my videos on sustainability within fashion and everything, it kind of applies to beauty and everything I suppose because I just don't want things to go to waste. Um, there was a time where obviously it's so amazing and so exciting to have this stuff sent to me. So there was a time when I just wanted to bring everything home because it is like, it's really exciting. And I really appreciate all of the brands um, that have sent me this incredible stuff. But there's only so much stuff that one girl can use, right? And wear. So there's, I think there's a few fashion bits in here. So a few bits of clothing that I'm so excited to have a look at. Um, but yeah, that's why I don't do these as often anymore because I just don't need it all. So let's have a look and see what we've got. I think there's some pretty good stuff in here. This light is really weird. It's like shade here and then immediate sunlight over here. Um, and I'm not using any lighting right now. It's pure natural lighting. So bear with me on that. I'm probably going to get blinded in a minute. Um, first things first. Oh, I saw a girl on bag. Where is it? Oh, here it is. My Guerlain bag! So, I met the lovely girls from Guerlain yesterday. We went to Selfridges and had a really nice coffee and they showed me around um, their new little uh, store that they have upstairs on the fourth floor. And they gave me some goodies, so I want to show you this stuff. This is kind of cheating, I suppose, because I know exactly what's in here. But, where is it? Here we go. This is the exciting stuff. This is a beautiful perfume bottle. Are you ready? Dun, dun, dun. And at the moment what they're doing exclusively at Selfridges is you can personalise a bottle. I chose the purple one um, and I also had the gold thread put on the top as well. Um, so yeah, you can personalise it and I had my name in gold. And it is so pretty. This is Mon Guerlain. I'm going to hide my face behind the bottle so that it focuses. No, go back to the bottle. There we go. So can you see my name there? It's gorgeous. And this is Mon Guerlain. The fragrance is just stunning. Oh, I love it so much. I just think it's the most beautiful, beautiful bottle. So yeah, I'm so, so happy. I'm grateful that they gave that to me. It's such a nice gift. And then a few of their other little launches. I hope I can show this. I hope it's not embargoed. I'm gonna have to check before I put this live that it can be spoken about right now, but this is their brand new serum. This is their Renew and Repair Serum, and it's double there. You can see the bottle is split. And I've only tried this on my hand yesterday, and but it just feels absolutely beautiful. I've been using the Guerlain oil for a long time now because it really heals. Um, so if I have any scarring or um, blemishes on my face, and you know when it just stays a bit red for a while, you use this oil and it's it honestly like you wake up with new skin and apparently this serum is like that but times 10. So I'm super excited to give that a go. Next, oh, I remember seeing this guy, a Pippin Nut Box. So Pippin Nut do um, nut butters and they are so delicious. I have their massive bucket of um, almond butter in my cupboard right now. I always call it a bucket. It's like, you know, the big tubs. So what have we got in here? The future's bright, the chocolate's orange. Right, so what is it? This is 
a limited edition chocolate orange almond butter. Oh my gosh, let's give this a go quickly. This video is gonna be so long. I'm only on the second thing and we've got two bags to go through, but you know, this is an emergency. We need to try this. Oh, it smells so good. I'm just gonna taste that bit then. Oh wow. Oh, oh, that's really good. So this is the packaging. I don't know um, where you can get this actually. I get my Pippa Nut from Whole Foods, but I'm sure they're in like normal supermarkets as well. That sun's come around so quickly. We've already got the blinding sun in my eyes. Okay, <laughs> let's do a really TMI product here, a very girly one. This is from Flo. And you guessed it, it's all about periods. I think they're tampons, yeah, they're tampons. But they are organic tampons. So the cotton in there is all organic, so it's much better for you. This is really pretty, look. I think a couple have come along. As pretty as tampons can be though, right? They're 100% organic cotton, certified by the Global Organic Textile Standard and produced according to the International Labour Organization's working standards. Pretty impressive. Sounds good. It's one of those things that I suppose that like, if you use tampons, you don't really even think about how good the tampon is in a weird way. Oh, what's this big box here? This looks good. I don't even know what it is yet. <gasps> Marcus Lepfer, one of my favorite designers. I'm obsessed. I love their stuff. So Marcus Lepfer is an incredible designer. I go to his um, presentations around London Fashion Week. Oh, goodbye, son. Um, I go to his presentations for London Fashion Week every single year and his collections are just stunning. I love the prints. Oh, jumper. Um, I need to ignore this for a second. He, his kind of signature are the big lips. So you get the jumpers and the t-shirts of the lips. And one of my favorite t-shirts is a plain white tee. And then in the corner, it's just got these bright red lips, that little logo. Oh, wow. I'm super, super excited. Okay. Oh, yes. I did actually choose this. I picked this out. They asked me to pick something from their new autumn winter collection. Look at that. Yes, okay, say hello to a jumper that you are going to be seeing me in pretty much every single day of winter. This is gonna be like an absolute staple in my wardrobe. I love the length of it. Oh, this is kind of a little bit making me excited for autumn winter, but I'm such a summer person. <laughs> I love the sun. I, when it comes to like autumn winter, I'm just like, oh, why did summer end? Oh, and I also got a shirt. Oh, I can already spot the little bumblebees. Who else has been loving the bumblebees this summer? I just, I know it sounds weird, but I think they're really cute. Oh, that's beautiful. Look at those colors. Oh, I can't wait. I could kind of tuck this in to a faux leather skirt and then put the jumper over the top. Oh, mm. love it. Thank you so much. Charlotte Tilbury, one of my favorite, favorite, favorite makeup brands. Let's have a little look. This must be a new launch. This must be the concealer. Do you know what? I don't think I have ever used Charlotte Tilbury's concealer. Oh, oh, oh I've seen it. I've seen this with the little sponge. Cute. Oh, I can't wait to give that a go. And the magic powder. I haven't used the magic powder either. I've got the little compact powder um, in the gold container that is always in my handbag for touch-ups with a little brush I have. Um, but I've never had the loose powder. I think this has like a bit of a shimmer in there. Let's just have a quick go. This is why my PO Box videos take forever because I just want to open everything and cause such a mess. I can't be one of those people to just be like, oh, that looks good, cool. Like I've need to check everything out. Yes, it does have a shimmer. Beautiful. Yes, some sweaty Betty workout clothes. Oh my gosh, one sec. Another parcel. That honestly scared me to death. I don't know what this is. <laughs> we can open that later. Um, sweaty Betty clothes. I, when I had a huge clear out of my wardrobe, I ended up accidentally giving away so many of my workout clothes. Um, they didn't go to waste. I obviously didn't throw anything away. But now my friends and family are wearing my workout clothes and I've hardly got anything left. <gasps> Super cool. I've actually wanted these for so long. These are their reversible shorts. But yeah, look, they're black as well. Totally reversible. Perfect. 
amazing. And what was, oh, this was a little top to go with it. And they, oh, it's the halter neck top. I got this for yoga. Cause I don't know how kind of supportive or whatever this top would be for actual gym stuff. Um, I got it for yoga. Cause I just thought that was really, really nice. Love it. Oh my God, I need to go and do some yoga tonight now to wear this. I've got pins and needles in my feet. Ah, oh, something from Aspinall. I have some really beautiful bags from Aspinall of London. The packaging is just always to die for, look. The tissue paper and the stickers, it just feels like true luxury, which is so nice when it's a gift. Oh, I've got a card holder with my initials on there. This is such a gorgeous colour. So there we go, I don't know, can you see that close? Um, you can see my initials down in this corner. And a lovely card holder and a Starbucks card in there. I wonder if that actually has anything on there. That is brilliant, I love that, thank you so much. Actually, I'm gonna keep that in there to keep it safe for now because I'm never gonna be able to find it amongst this stuff. Okay, I um, spotted this obviously at Glean. This is by Neom. This is a well-being pod. It's a um, diffuser, but it's electronic. So let's see. Cause I, I have um, the normal reed diffusers everywhere. Can you see one? Can you see that far? I don't know if you can see that far. In that corner, I've got a diffuser there. They're like everywhere in the house. This is exciting stuff. You've got on, so I guess you can have it permanently on. You've got one hours, two hours, three hours. So I guess you can give it like an hour boost or however long you want. And then there's a mist button and there's also a light. So I bet when you have this on, it glows really beautifully in the evening. <gasps> Yay! Okay, finally, this is a gorgeous basket bag. So basically, um, one of my friends, Toby, his girlfriend has just set up this new basket bag um, brand and it's absolutely beautiful and they were so kind, they um, sent me one. But I haven't opened it, as you can see, I haven't even seen, seen it yet. It's called Hura, H-U-R-A. So I opened this. Oh, gorgeous. Wow, oh my goodness. So the story is that uh, she used to travel a lot to Morocco. Oh my goodness. And like just saw all of these amazing baskets and wanted to create them over here. <gasps> That's beautiful, look at that color. That is absolutely gorgeous. Um, I will link everything in the description box down below so that you can find it because you're probably not catching like everything I'm saying but this is Hura and um, yeah absolutely gorgeous go and check it out in the description box down below oh we've got a couple of luxury bits here from Dior so as you guys know I'm a huge fan of Dior makeup and their beauty products I it kind of ticks that box for me of pure luxury makeup oh that sun has just come out of nowhere it's so blinding sorry I don't even know if it's gonna focus on me yeah I love mixing up like everything in my makeup bag is a whole variety of high-end and then drugstore pieces but when it comes to that high-end stuff just I adore Dior, j'adore Dior. So we've got this lovely little package here, Dior Backstage. We have got some foundations. So I'll obviously have to test these and see which one um, suits me most. Oh, these are gorgeous palettes. We have got a lip palette there. Oh, I thought it was eyeshadow, beautiful. Already got my eye on this. This is the eyeshadow palette. They are all of the kind of colors and shades that I wear. Those lovely golds, browns, champagnes. It's basically all I wear these days. I'm not very experimental. And then what's this? This is a glow face palette. So a combination there of highlighters and blushes. And then this must be the bronzer contour palette. There we go. Lovely. And then a couple of brushes for the foundations. And then we also have a nice little package here with Dior stickers on there. I wanna make sure I've got no makeup on my hands because this is white. Oh wow, oh my goodness. We have got a Dior silk dressing gown with Dior backstage on it. That is beautiful. That is the perfect summer dressing gown. That's the kind of dressing gown you just wanna do your makeup in every day, <laughs> but it's too 
white and pristine to get dirty. Wow, totally, totally spoiled. Oh, there's another little eyeshadow palette in here. What's this? Brow, brow palette. I didn't even spot that one. There we go. Can you see that? That's the brow palette. Amazing. Don't worry, we're nearly at the bottom of this bag. What a, okay, here we go. I'm just gonna get the last few things out. <gasps> Guys, this one, this is amazing. My feet got pins and needles. Right, I'm gonna start with this guy. We have got the Ocean Pearl Hydrate Mate water bottle from the cover. It looks beautiful. Oh, look at those colours. That is gorgeous. Oh, oh, has my name on it. Can you see? Yay! Everything's better with your name on it. <laughs> I love that. That is a really, really cool bottle. And I do this really annoying thing with my water bottles where I just keep leaving them everywhere. It's really driving me mad. So I actually do need another one. So that's perfect. This here, oh, I am so excited. So do you guys remember when I went to uh, Bordeaux with Cordelie? Um, I went on like a press trip and they, it was on a vineyard, so where Cordely make their, um, all of their beauty products, it's also a vineyard, because they use the grapes. And we tasted the most beautiful bottle of white wine. Now, I don't drink that much, um, but I do like the odd glass of wine, you know, for dinner. Um, I also do love a G&T, but that's just a side note. When it comes to wine, oh, this bottle of white, it was their 2015 limited edition because 2015 was like a really good year for them i couldn't get over how delicious it was but i stupidly didn't buy um the wine when i was there so <laughs> basically they when they were next in bordeaux the team from quarterly they brought me back a bottle and then this ended up in my p.o box so i mean that's just so unbelievably kind i can't believe they did that but it's amazing and i can't wait to um, have a nice glass of this. Right, we're on to the second bag now, and this one isn't as full. Big box. Let's see if we can get this. Oh, oh, this is from Three Floor. I actually borrow a lot from Three Floor for like big events and stuff. Oh, this is stunning. Right, so this is from their autumn winter collection, and it's this beautiful black lace dress and the sleeves are sheer, like it's actually got a polka dot sheer kind of mesh. Can you see that? That is beautiful. And then it also has the high neck. I need to find <laughs> an occasion, some kind of excuse to wear that too. It just, oh, feels stunning. Right, next, I think this is the bag with kind of small little bits and bobs. So we have a Marc Jacobs beauty box here. Oh, it looks like a mascara. This is the Velvet Noir Major Volume Mascara for Epic Lashes. Very nice. Ah, oh, and they've put my name on it as well. Can you see at the end? Very nice. Mark Jacobs is there somewhere. Let's have a quick look. Nice bottle. Hexagonal <laughs> mascara. We've got a Jo Malone bag here. Here we go. So I am a super fan of Jo Malone. Almost like how I have reed diffusers around the house. Every candle pretty much in every room is a Jo Malone candle. I've got one up here on my fireplace. I've got one behind me on that table over there. And I've also got the, I've got the room spray over there and I've got another candle on the shelf up there. And that's just the lounge. Literally fangirl over Jo Malone products. They are, like there's nothing else like them. So I actually had a meeting yesterday with Bianca from Jo Malone. So we've already gone through this, but I need to show you guys. So this is their latest launch. It is the Honeysuckle and Davana. Oh my goodness. And so one thing that they do, they source the Honeysuckle in the UK. And at first they went to pick the Honeysuckle in the daytime, but then they realized that it's actually far more fragrant uh, at dusk. So they picked all of the honeysuckle at dusk and that's what's in this bottle. It's just the most divine, divine fragrance. And of course we have the candle. Very happy about this. And um, one thing, you know, Jo Malone is that you compare all of the fragrances together. Um, so this is the main one, the honeysuckle, but you can also pair it with the grapefruit, which I'm 100% going to be doing because I love citrus um, notes in fragrances. But then we also have the oud and bergamot. 
so that would actually be really nice for Joe. So we could both have this, but he could pair it with this and I can pair it with the, the grapefruit and each fragrance would be totally different, but that would be kind of like the base, I suppose. Oh, just divine. Oh, I remember seeing this. This is a canvas um, print of me. It's amazing, the only problem is I don't have a card that goes with it. So I don't know if a brand had this made and it came with a product, or if actually someone that watches my videos or follows me on social media um, created this and sent it to me with a letter, but I don't know, which really, really, really upsets me. But I just thought that was really brilliant. So wherever it's come from, at least I have it. It's with me in my home. If, um, if you have any ideas, please do comment down below because I would love to know who sent that. Okay, so I've got here from the body shop, my absolute fave, the almond milk body yogurt. I actually worked with um, the body shop about a month or two ago on their body yogurts and I've just gotten through them so ridiculously quickly and they have replenished my almond milk one. So I'm super happy about that. And they've also sent the almond milk and honey uh, shower cream, which I haven't used yet. So I'm very happy that I have that to go with it. And um, where should we go? Okay, steam bags. I actually use these herbs and spices. Uh, I get them on Amazon. And then I noticed yesterday when I was at Glean picking up my stuff, they've sent me some organic turmeric. And, or do you say turmeric, turmeric? Who knows, I think everyone says it differently. But also some organic fair trade black pepper. I think all of their spices and everything are fair trade and organic, so absolutely brilliant. So that's amazing. And I actually needed some new black pepper for my grinder. This is from Neom, so I bet this goes with our diffuser. I've got a pack of little essential oils. If I twist these all around, I can show you. So we have got the Sleep Essential Oil Blend of Lavender, Sweet Basil and Jasmine. We've also got the De-Stress, we've got the Boost Your Energy and then also Make You Happy. They sound amazing. And then from Ren, this sounded really interesting. So this is Ren Clean Skincare. This is their Atlantic Kelp and Magnesium Anti-Fatigue Body Wash. And I kept the card here. So I remember thinking it was really interesting and I wanted to chat to you guys about it. So this bottle is 20% plastic reclaimed from the ocean and 80% of the plastic is recycled from empty plastic bottles. So it's 100% recycled. And there's no metal spring on the inside. That's interesting. No metal spring in there, so it's 100% recyclable. And they've partnered with TerraCycle to create this bottle. And it's from oceans, beaches, rivers, lakes, and the banks of those waterways where the plastic from the ocean has been recycled. So amazing. I love this new initiative, it's brilliant. And then I also have some divine chocolate. This is smooth dark chocolate with raspberries. Oh, sounds dreamy. As we're onto food, I have got from Mind Fuel some organic plant-based posh teff Porridge, teff porridge. I keep meaning to get into teff because it's meant to be really great for your gut. Um, so it's like another grain, I presume it's a grain, and it says here it's a source of iron and magnesium and it's naturally free from gluten. So I look forward to trying these. I love how they're in little individual sachets. Oh, here we go. An absolute classic, the Dolce & Gabbana light blue fragrance. And then this guy is a healthy glow stick. So I wonder if this is a on the go fragrance stick. It actually is a glow stick, wow. Oh, it's a highlighter, that's beautiful. I love that packaging. Can you see on the top as well, there's the little lemon, like a little sticker. That is brilliant. Oh, love it so much. Thank you so, so much. Um, oh, I forgot to mention also from the body shop, I picked up the instant soothing mask. This is the almond milk with oats as well. Oh, it's just delicious. I think that almond fragrance collection is my favorite. I just can't get enough of it. Um, I also have here from NARS, I've got two separate NARS lip glosses. This is their full vinyl lip lacquer in Conquest. 
and I think I chose this one because I just thought uh, I would get so much use out of it. It's like a beautiful nudie pinky colour. And then I've also got the Velvet Lip Glide in Zen Zenon? Zenon? I can't pronounce it. And this is more of like a beigey nude colour. Just both colours that I would literally wear on a day-to-day -day basis, so I really look forward to trying these. Guys, we're down to the last two! Sorry if I've been going on forever. Right, I've got... This is from Dolce & Gabbana Miss Sicily Colour and Care Lipstick. I've picked this one. This is beautiful. Look at this. It's like a red. It looks red there, but it's more of like a balmy colour, so I've just put that on top of the highlighter that I put on earlier. But if you can see that, it's not like a bright red. It's the kind of red that you could have in your handbag and top up throughout the day and do it almost without a mirror because it is balmy. It's not like hugely pigmented, but pigmented enough. And then this is, ah, oh, it's my absolute fave. This is the perfect thing to finish on. This is the Bobbi Brown Smoky Eye Mascara that I have been wearing for so long. It's one of my favorites and I ran out the other day and they have topped me up. Amazing. I love this mascara. It's so, so, so good. So that is everything, guys. I really hope you've enjoyed watching this video. I mean, not bad, eh? We've got some really great stuff here. Honestly, it blows me away every single time. This never gets normal. It always feels like Christmas every time I pick up my PO Box stuff. Um, and I'm so grateful to those brands that have put the time and effort into sending me their new collections, but even sending me things that they know I love just to replenish my makeup bag. So yeah, it's absolutely amazing. But I hope you've enjoyed it and I will see you guys very, very soon. Bye.